Leo's 6P, the anti-air, has its upper body invuln removed, but it's now has armor for highs. All right, here we go. First match of the night. Uh, first Guilty match here. Raven versus uh, Jacko. Van versus Zacko. Okay, we got some decent pressure. Pushing himself out. No, early no mix up. Good anti here though. I like the burst. Throwing down houses. Raven does really well at dealing with houses if Jacko doesn't have Aegis up. Since the uh, bullets do get destroyed by Aegis. All right. Looks like uh, Zacko's got the army out. Yeah. But he is getting hit. A lot. And I'm sure Van has no idea what this matchup's supposed to be. Oh, yeah. Way. I don't think a lot of people know what this matchup or any matchup with Jacko is supposed to be like here. Throw him into the corner. We've got the army coming out. We do have level 2 um, guys. Not really getting a good confirms. Get him overhead. Going cross up and low, but he gets DP'd. That was weird. I think that was cross up, but Van just blocked it low. Wow, look at these footsies. Getting him low with the slide. Going for Calvados. Doesn't hit it. So he does force the block. Goes low. Jacko is blocking very nicely. Doesn't get the confirm into 4D. But we do have the army coming up on him. Okay, this is going to be really hard for uh, Van to deal with. Burst was a really good situation. Nice. Getting him with... Um, Air dash S. Strong start 2P, that's pretty nice. Oh, that was a random burst. That was Canadian. Alright, we got the grinder going. Going high. Going high again. Get some low, though. Going low, but Zach blocks it. Alright, that was a weird trade with the uh, sweep. I don't think. Van knows his uh, anti DP setups yet. Yeah. Okay, nice. He has Aegis out. Ooh, nice reversal. And that'll take round one. Van. Fresh off uh, another Street Fighter win. So, yeah. He's on the high. Move. Man, look how slow some of the characters get after they get hit by Raven's Needle. Nice pressure. I didn't even know that slows people down at the last Yeah. Game. It's like a really good spacing tool, just in general, actually. Ooh. Van trying to throw a projectile into the Aegis. Oh, he doesn't get the extra confirm off of the uh, guys hitting him. Wow, that's look really tough. Look, how do you see that? That's like so hard to see. Another dust. Nice burst. Burst really is like such an important tool in this mix in this uh, matchup. In any matchup with Jacko, just because like if you get yourself into a situation like that, the only thing that's gonna save you is guard cancel, random supers, and um, burst. And especially now that they're level three, like only thing that can save them is getting hits. And he's got to continuously get hits for the next bit because minions are coming out. He is pushed out. Calvados gets him. Getting the confirm. Oh, it doesn't get the ender. And he just dies because he's trying to do a block string with uh, the spear minion around. This character is so annoying to deal with. Nice confirm. Going to be getting some boxes out. Getting Aegis out. Aegis the is so good. will be saying, I, it's really pretty, but I have no idea what's going on. Most of us don't know what's going so, on in this matchup. This is mainly Jacko. Jacko is hard to keep track of if you don't know what she does. But basically, she puts houses down that summon the little minions, and they level up as the houses are down. But every time you hit them, um, they'll lose HP. And for every level, they gain 2 HP starting at 3 at level 1. Oh, nice with punish on the 2H. Getting Aegis out. But Van is really dealing well with the Aegis now. Not really using projectiles. Nice anti with 6P. Oh, random 2H doesn't get whip punished. Raven's 2H is such like a good button. Oh, what was he staying in stance for? He doesn't have Aegis out. 
heading him low. Zaku has such little HP, but he does have the uh, minion army out. Man, clock up is so good. Look at that. That overhead that you can't normally confirm off of just gets confirmed. But Van. I don't know who died there. <laughs> I'm so confused. I'm like, did Van get hit by the minion or did the, the projectile but minions hit can't kill. Oh, they can't? Yeah, minions can't kill. They can only do damage until you have 1 HP. And then you actually have to take proper chip damage from Jacko herself. Or damage. Okay, that's good to know. Yeah. Because if they did chip damage, that would be super dangerous. They do do chip damage. But oh, no, they if they could kill, kill, they can't kill. That would be super if dangerous. If they could kill, that'd be dumb. That'd be so dumb. The character would be like, soul busted. <laughs> Getting hit high, though, that was a safe DP area. Jack, uh, Zacko, usually uh, DP heavy. Nice anti air. Oh, that dive kick gets hit by the projectile. Oh, but the dive kick hits the 6P. Going low, nice. And that'll take the set. 2 0 -oh for Van. 2 0, -oh, Van stays up. Are oh, you going to play on stream? Van really uh, doing quite fine there. The scrambles, though, were not really good situations at all for Van there. Man, looking at these changes, they're so... I heard Van coming up next with Resident Bedman, Timothy Blackwell, Kellyon. Station 1, Guilt Spear, Squeaky and Zacho. Station 2, Guilt Spear, Daniel and Sacred Panda. So Tim versus, well not Tim, Benman versus Raven. Um, see, 